Hey guys, the following clip is about solving fractional equations in algebra using cross multiplying. Enjoy! When solving fractional equations, the method we use is we cross multiply. For me to explain cross multiplication, we are going to use the following example, which is 4x over 5 is equal to 2 over 3. There are three steps we need to follow to be able to find the value of x. When I'm asked to solve an equation, it always relates to finding the value of an unknown. So let's start with step one. First thing is I'm going to rewrite my equation, which is 4x over 5 is equal to 2 over 3. Step one is I need to cross multiply. What is meant by cross multiply is I am going to draw a big multiplication symbol over my equal sign. And now I need to cross multiply from the top of this line to the bottom of this line. And the same on the other side. I've color coded it to make it easy. So I need to multiply this 4x by 3. So 4x times 3 is equal to 12x. So I'm going to write 12x on the left hand side of the equal sign. It does not matter which side you write the answers, just as long as one of the answers is on the left and the other one is on the right. So I've done the green part, now I need to do the purple part. 5 times 2 is equal to 10. I need to make sure that my answers for the different sides is on different sides of the equal sign. Then we go to step number two, rearranging the equation. With rearranging the equation, we need to be sure that all my unknowns is on the left-hand side and all my numbers is on the right-hand side. Now this one is already rearranged because I've got my unknowns here and my numbers here. So in this case, I don't need to do step number two. Then I go on to step number three, which is find the value of the unknown. So I'm going to rewrite my rearranged equation, which in this case I don't need. So let's write it over there. I don't need to do step number two because it's already done. So I need to find the value of x. So let's have 12x is equal to 10. I need to have x alone. Way I get x alone is I need to get rid of this 12. I need to do the opposite of what the 12 is doing at this stage. Right now the 12 is multiplying by x. The opposite of multiplication is division. Divide by 12 on the left. What I do on the left I need to do on the right. So I need to divide by 12 on the right as well. Rewrite it. x is equal to 10 over 12. This is not the simplest form that it could possibly be. 2 can be perfectly divided into 10 as well as 12. So therefore, when I rewrite it, my simplified answer will be 5 over 6. And that is how you cross multiply by following these three simple steps, rearranging and then finding the value. I hope this clip helped. If it did, please like this video, subscribe to my channel, share it with anyone it might possibly benefit. If you have any questions, please drop it in the comment section below and I'll get back to you as soon as I possibly can. Please also find the link to the rules of algebra over here. See you next time. Bye.